been deployed to British Columbia to help rescue and evacuate thousands of people stranded by floodwaters. The port of Vancouver has been all but cut off and already there are reports of food shortages. In British Columbia, roadways have become waterways. Meteorologists warned about an extreme weather event days ago, but this has broken all records. Unprecedented floods and landslides. A woman's body recovered from this mudslide. Authorities fearful there'll be others. We were on the chopper looking down and everything was brown. Like, I mean, it was just, I've never seen anything like it before. There's been widespread damage to bridges and highways, stranding thousands. The port of Vancouver all but cut off, with reports of food shortages and concerns about stockpiling. Canada's Prime Minister calling it a terrible disaster and deploying the Air Force. There are hundreds of Canadian Armed Forces members uh, currently headed to British Columbia to help with everything from supplies to evacuation to whatever is needed. There are thousands more on standby. A state of emergency declared across the province. Scientists say it was caused by an atmospheric river, a phenomenon predicted to become more common with climate change. We need to act now to make the changes in our community and in our economy that will protect us from these types of events in the future. The owners of this house watched it collapse and float away. It went under. It just, the river just took it under and gone. Within seconds. We've lived through COVID, we've lived through the fires, and we'll live through this. Farmers and locals had their work cut out for them when they disobeyed an evacuation order to rescue cattle at this flooded dairy farm. When I see calves that are underwater that they rescued and threw in the boat to save them, I, I mean, on one hand it breaks my heart, but on the other hand, uh, I'm just so impressed with our community. More heavy rain is forecast in coming days amid concerns snow at high elevations will melt and create even more flooding.